Come on down to Novark's garage in the tax exemption zone of Novak for the best prices on badass cars. And for the best deals on vehicle modifications. Novark added a bomb to this truck with no questions asked. We will be driving it to the Republic in response to their taxation demands. Careful, they got spies all over. On all purchases over 100 caps get a free fuel refill. And remember, all Nuka Colas are three caps. The tax exemption son of Novak has been thriving lately under the supervision of both myself and Chet Nobar. You parked the vertebrate on top of that van. Now we will have to pay reparations. Careful. They got spies all over. The Republic do indeed have spies attempting to enter Novak, but that is a story for a different day. I sent Victor to look out for the town. And Novak has employed Goris full time to do the same. Lots of specialist equipment doesn't come cheap. Novak must be modding some Brahmin Baron's rides on the side. I love little Easter eggs like this. Let's take a look inside the garage. I like the look of this so far. The garage interior has a place to cook food and a jukebox to listen to some tunes. A modest bed with a footlocker for personal possessions nearby and a medkit for when you get into scrapes on the battlefield. Naturally we installed a myth lab for you to continue to destabilize Republic strongholds. Along with a workbench for when you want to craft some bullshit as well as a violin and some sheet music for when you want to be musical. And finally we have the PSD Resistance, a fully working next generation Rocco gaming terminal. If you like the sticker on this gaming terminal, you can buy yourself one using the link in the description of this Rocco holotape. Here is some gameplay of role playing modern games. Using this Rocco terminal I clearly am the best in next gen 2281 game. Get shit on new. These guys would never have survived the gaming lobby in 2077. Finally, we have a hat stand and a metal detector around the door for when Republic Glowies try to get inside with guns. <laughs> Test out the new motors at No Bark's garage. Welcome to Jacobstown. Courier, I notice that you and Mr. Ross have been on a series of house tours. I humbly invite you into my home to show off how some it is to live in Novik, away from the common goals. No tour will be complete without showing off my pit bike owner named Shaggy. He is a good boy. If you check around the back, you will see my moonshine shack and outdoor garden. Always go to grow a bit of your own food and make some strong moonshine. Let's go inside. I got me one of them radish and cokers. I have a pristine Nuka cold fridge to store my three cap coals. A bookshelf with tons of things the company goes tried to steal from me with a record player on top. I got this new fish tank, but I don't have any fish yet. I have a jukebox, which you were hearing the music which is playing through. The old water kip. Too bad I'm trying to sit to get my motion operation working with it. Some pulled out code probably is this. This terminal is what I was to warn America the company goes through it. You can see an ammo dispenser to the right of it and my trusty sidearm to the left. Watch out, courier. Coming costs as Novart would say are attacking his home. Defend Novart.
thank you for helping to defend my home courier. And I hope you enjoyed the tour of my new home. Courier, today we will be making some 80% proof moonshine and getting drunk as fuck. Hi there. Welcome to the Westside Co-op. I'm Clayton Etienne. Let me know if you have any questions. You need to purchase a load of maize in order to brew the moonshine. So buy it in bulk. Another satisfied customer. Super Mutant Companion, interesting choice. I guess we need to meet our diversity quota for recruitment policies. You need to put in four maize inside and wait for four days for it to brew. Go do something constructive for four days. Good job, Courier. That was very constructive. Now go see if the moonshine is any Be good. sure not to drink it all, Courier. That could be bad. Don't do it, Courier. Hey, you. You're finally awake. Howdy, what can I do for you? It's nice, quiet, and it's got plenty of shade for this old flake bag to rest up after my shift. Oh, it's no trouble. If anything, that old hoot no bark will keep them away with his rambling. Well, who the hell's asking? You ever heard of manners? Come on, lighten up a little. I've seen death claws with more chill than you. You want to buy something? I hail from Barstow, California. It's quite a walk from here, but if you follow the I-15, you would easily find it. Don't get me wrong. NCR isn't much worse off than here, but I'm getting old now, and it ain't what it used to be. Great stuff. Take a look. Good luck on the road, kid. You should get some rest, courier, before. What the fuck? I guarantee the Republic are behind this. We need to stop them. They even blew up Nobark's body double. All these beautiful cars reduced to rubble. And for what? Because we refused to pay money to the Republic. They even put bombs in the fucking vending machine. They were so enraged at the price of three caps for Nuka Cola. Courier, deliver this truck to the new California Republic. It contains my response to their taxation demands. Gather round, gather round, good people of the Republic. I have ice cream for you. Do me proud, Courier. <laughs> 